Price from Eden Condensed Small Space Garden Design. And this is Garden Space. So I'm here with my very large pot and at the end of a long winter, if you leave pots outdoors, a lot of times what will happen is they get dirty, they get full of leaves, and if you've had a damp winter, they might also have moss that's gathered on them as well. So before you plant anything new in it, it's important that you clean the pot to make sure that you get rid of any kind of fungus, mildew, uh, insects, so that way when you put your potting soil in and your plants in, that they have the best start possible. And one of the easiest ways to do it is obviously take your pot outside, get yourself a handy dandy squirt bottle uh, filled with water, um, probably about two thirds of the way up and household white distilled vinegar. This is a great thing to use as a cleaning agent. You can also use a little bit of biodegradable dish soap as well, but this won't cause as much suds in your, in your driveway. So I've actually uh, added a couple of tablespoons of vinegar to my water. And first thing I'm gonna do is clean out the dried leaves that are in here, because we don't need those. And I'm going to take my spray bottle and I'm going to very liberally spritz all of the pot here, especially on the inside. And make sure that you get it nice and soaked as well, because um, you want to be able to clean it off the best you can. If there's moss on the outside, you can go ahead and spray the outside with your vinegar and water solution. And then I have a nice uh, steel brush here. You want to be careful. This is a terracotta pot. I don't mind if it gets a little scraped up. If you've got a nice glazed pot, you may want to use a softer brush. And uh, especially if you, but if you've got a lot of moss or mud on your pots, then this is a, a good tool to have. And then just use it to scrape off any kind of dirt. If there's bird poop or anything like that, get that off and good. You may want to use your, uh, spritzer bottle while you're doing it. And then finally, at the end of that is uh, set your hose attachment to jet. Uh, tilt the pot away from you and, okay, so now I have no water pressure. <laughs> and give it a good squirt here. Hopefully you'll have more water pressure than I do. And that will rinse all of the dirt down through the, the drainage hole so you don't have to pick up this heavy pot. And you should be good, good to go. If you've got some stubborn stains on there, you may need to do a, a second application of the vinegar water, the scrubbing, and then the rinsing. And then after that, let your pot sit out in the sun to dry, and then you're good to go to plant. If you have any other questions about how to clean out a large pot at the end of winter, please contact me at www.edencondense.com. Thank you very much.